Helen, who did a good push up button. What's your name? Helen. Helen. Nice to meet you, Helen. Thanks for helping us. Because we can't click on buttons, so we need people to help us on it. <laughs> and now that's for the fantasy subject. Okay. Oh my god. Wow, uh, can you press start again? <laughs> no. No. Hey. That's great because this shows exactly how we do in production. Like uh, usually like companies come to us like uh, the most crazy subject, even crazier than those. And or sometimes it's very basic, like space marriage in space. But today is a very good example of how we're going to work on the team and who's going to do what. We have no clue, we haven't prepared it at all, so uh, which one is going to be the first computer to do it? What do you guys think? Uh, the luminescent dinosaur? Yeah. yeah? Okay, so we're going to start on this one. Uh, who's going who's to work on that? Thierry is a hero for dinosaurs. And werewolf. <laughs> <laughs> I know you are. <laughs> The Sebastian always starts with the moon. Uh, he always starts with like uh, some kind of major contrast, a ground, like what he's doing right now, uh, and a major moon to decide what the rest of the image is going to be. Very important because lighting is obviously what makes an image. Uh, without light, no, no, nothing to see. So uh, uh, having that background in, uh, in uh, photography is always very important. We don't have a favorite software. We always say that if you can do a concept art with a toilet brush and ink, and it looks badass, I don't care. Awesome. Yeah. <laughs> now, if you can do it faster than with a toilet brush, with Photoshop, well, now it's a production question. We work a lot with, the, with some shots from, from movies like uh, Alien or something like that. So the best way to have a realistic uh, mood in your scene is to work with the same kind of references that uh, shot works. The thing is that it's like using 3D in your painting. No, we do sometimes use screen painting to help uh, making a shot faster. The great thing about references is that it, it trains you. It trains your eye to see things a certain way or whatever. The, most, the biggest danger with using photo or references is to become a slave of that. So, well, as you can see, like very quickly, uh, Joel uh, added the, the dinosaur that's uh, about to embrace. <laughs> that's awesome. Yeah, let's keep it. Hell yeah. <laughs> so what would you change? The front. <laughs> uh, yeah. Yeah. The world is okay. She's lean. She's sexy. But producer is <laughs> Yeah. See, that's that's the problem we have all the time. Like people like this jumping on and and saying bullshit, you know. <laughs> <laughs> okay, but we have to deal with that, so...